All right, guys, we're gonna we're driving right now, enjoying my 190E. The door panels are off right now because I'm doing lots of work on window regulators and lubrication, blah blah blah. So I'm gonna go right now to a place and show you a W115 that's for sale uh, for like 800 bucks or something. So. Um, I just saw it. I just was like, actually I didn't talk to the seller. I just uh, passed it by. I saw it, and um, yeah, I wanted to show it to you. So we'll see the condition of it. I'm not sure, but I thought you guys will enjoy. And it's a pretty foggy day here in Pacific Northwest, Washington. Uh, yeah, but I love this kind of weather. I don't, I don't like when it's too hot or too cold. But this is like a perfect weather. It's not too hot, not too cold. So it's amazing. Wow. driver you know mustangs everywhere so it's fine <laughs> so as far as this car i love this car so much i mean um i just talked to a person and the owner should be here soon so i just talked to the owner over there back he's really cool he's had this car for quite a while and he really loves this thing and he told me that it runs and drives and uh he drove it you know this year earlier um and this car is pretty cool and he actually told me that he's selling it for 300 bucks so i mean i would love to pick it up but initially what i wanted to do is help him get it running getting it running because i thought that it's not running but he said that it's running right now so that's awesome and the only thing that it needs is you know floorboards and some stuff but uh it's a great car um and uh yeah uh we're gonna stay in touch i mean and i told him that i will help him you know work on it if he needs uh so he just needs to make up his mind but the only reason why he's selling it right now is because pff, his wife said that he uh you know needs to get rid of it you know <laughs> regular thing you know that's why i think i'm still single you know because i don't need someone to tell me to sell all my toys and buy a minivan so that's a true story but uh it's a beautiful car you know yeah it's not perfect you know it's sad because he told me that the person who drove this car he gave it to a person to drive it and then something happened and the person was tweaking with it and blah 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 and then he let it sit for afterwards so but yeah it's a pretty sweet car i really like it you know i love those door handles so much and um oh, it's just a beauty i love this thing so much so I'm definitely uh, gonna go ahead and come back here probably at some point and uh, yeah I really want to hear this engine running and maybe I'll drive it around too so it's awesome there's the owner right there pulled up in his uh, Mitsubishi so almost an identical to the one I have yeah different color but it was like a 70 
four or five or whatever. Yeah. And it had 997,000 miles on it. That's and I was amazing. Like, yeah. Oh, that's these a cars cool go car, and go. And that's why I kept it. Yeah. <laughs> these cars go and go. That's awesome, though. Yeah. We've had it for almost three years. Yeah. So uh, but I, I haven't gotten enough driving out of it. So, yeah. And obviously well, she needs some work, you know. She like, that's, that's the problem with like uh, people is that usually when they buy these cars, they just drive them. That's the sad part, you know. I mean, they need, Instead they of. They need the tension. You know, ex they, these cars, I mean, they're like 40 years old right now. 40, 50 years old. They need attention. You gotta you know? love them. And give it back. you know, thinking, thinking about like how long these cars last and the parts in them and everything oh, still yeah. original. Like it's insane. It's amazing. You, you know, know, some of those, some of those trucks that they made in Germany in the 40s and the it's still going, yeah, man. It's still going. <laughs> yes, yes, hey, John. Nice man, nice meeting you. Time. I'm gonna get going. I'll talk to you later. Okay, you have my number. Take care. See that? It's amazing i love the owners like that you know he didn't scrap this car he kept this car and it's it's big props to you john if you're watching this video i mean you're you're amazing thank you thank you for doing all that thank you for not throwing away classic mercedes and keeping it you know um and what we're gonna do is he just told me is we're gonna i'm gonna come here once a month or something i'm gonna work on it so I'm so excited. <laughs> That's awesome. I live like an hour away, but it doesn't matter. You know, I can come here and just work on this baby. So, all right, guys. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you this car, just share my thoughts. And, uh, yeah, I really love this car. I mean, th even though it's in the shape as it is, you know, it needs uh, floors welded and other stuff, but it needs to be on the road. So, I have the owners, his name is John. I have the owner's phone number and we're gonna keep in touch and if he needs any help or if he decides to keep this car I'm gonna help him out with restoration of this car anyways guys if you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching safe classic Mercedes and other classic cars and you know hit the like and subscribe to my channel I'll see you in the next one take care